besides being a source of food fish mammals reptiles salt and other marine food stuff the tides can be harnessed to provide power when we talk about oceanography that is the science of the oceans it has become such an important aspect of our environment that a lot of researches are being conducted into the deep seas by many institutions universities government ministries and other international organizations the most famous international oceanographic research center is the international council for exploration of the sea with its headquarters in copenhagen Ocean exploration for the observation and recording of oceanographic data is very expensive matter. It involves the operation and maintenance of specially equipped vessels in mid-ocean for long periods. And large-scale oceanographic researches are therefore best undertaken by international bodies. The oceans comprise more than 70% 140 million square miles of the Earth's surface and have tremendous potential waiting to be developed. besides being a source of food fish mammals reptiles salt and other marine food stuff the tides can be harnessed to provide power formal oceanographic investigation began only with the british expedition of the challenger that is the navigation ship in between 1873 to 1876 which was the first successful worldwide deep sea expedition the older eco sounding technology have now been replaced by radar sounding and electrical eco devices to find the precise depth of ocean floors and map the relief of oceans trained frogmen equipped with modern breathing apparatus are employed to gather valuable information from great depth deep sea core samples are obtained by boring for the study of the oceanic deposits the various kind of oozes muds and clays automatic recording thermometers and other sensitive instruments can be lowered to any required depth by stationary vessels with laboratory facilities for processing any required data for the observation and measurement of current flow various kinds of current meters using propellers vanes or pendulums have been designed sealed bottles and other floating objects containing instructions for reporting their precise time and place of discovery are released in large numbers to compute the rate and direction of drift and current flow With all these modern techniques at the disposal of the oceanographers our knowledge of the mysteries of the ocean is greatly increased but there is still much to be discovered this sums up our discussion on oceanography or exploring the ocean as such thank you so much for watching if you do like watching such content do subscribe and do not forget to comment as well